Tonight, Charles de Gaulle Airport remains open with flights landing and taking off, though security has been heightened. Less than two hours ago, Air France passengers at Boston's Logan Airport departed for Paris. Many passengers, though, understandably shaken by what's transpired in the city. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lanz is live at Logan with reaction that's new tonight. Shannon and Mike, the mood is mellow for those passengers scheduled to board that plane to Paris. Some of them spoke with me and said they chose not to get on that plane. Security has been stepped up in Boston and here at Logan International Airport after those attacks in Paris. State police say there is no specific threat to Massachusetts, but they have increased security here at Logan. Local authorities are closely monitoring developments out of France. That 8, 10 p.m. Air France flight to Paris left from here. Meanwhile, a group of travelers chose not to board the plane. Now, we spoke with a married couple from Maine celebrating their 25th wedding anniversary and also a woman and her husband who frequents Paris because they have an apartment there. Take a listen to what they had to say. We are so saddened right now. It's just, it's, it's, it's hard to come up with words for this. It's just, it's, it's shocking. Paris is not going to be Paris, not for a while. So even if this dies down and, and the, every, all the museums are open Monday or Tuesday, it's still going to be a dark cloud. We love being in Paris and it's just so sad for us and just so heartbreaking to hear that this is going on right now in the center of Paris. And Massachusetts State Police remain on scene here. Reporting live at Logan Airport with the Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News. And tonight there's heightened security at Paris Charles de Gaulle Airport, but flights are still landing and taking off. And earlier this evening, passengers aboard Air France left Boston's Logan Airport for Paris, but for some, the tragedy causing them to change their travel plans. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance is live at Logan Airport with more reaction. Mike and Shannon, a group of passengers set to board that plane in Paris chose not to get on board, and they say they'd rather be safe than sorry. Security has been stepped up in Boston and here at Logan International Airport after those attacks in Paris. State police say there is no specific threat to Massachusetts, but they have increased security here at Logan. Local authorities are closely monitoring developments out of France. That 8, 10 p.m. Air France flight to Paris left from here. Meanwhile, a group of travelers chose not to board the plane. Now, we spoke with a married couple from Maine celebrating their 25th wedding anniversary and also a woman and her husband who frequents Paris because they have an apartment there. Take a listen to what they had to say. Something has to happen, you know, in France with, with the immigration situation. If we had flown out yesterday, um, we were staying in a place that didn't have Wi-Fi, so our family couldn't get in touch, wouldn't have been able to get in touch with us, and yeah. it would have been really hard, um, so we're grateful. After what happened with Charlie Hebdo, we thought that was an enormous, horrible thing, and, and this is ten times, if not more, worse. And Massachusetts State Police presence remains on scene here. Reporting live at Logan Airport with the Mobile Newsroom, Shantae Lands, Eyewitness News.